Language. Viewer discretion is advised. Set. Tonight, you're invited to the season's biggest party. Join 20 other revelers for a night of fun and games. Being dumb isn't illegal, it's just frowned upon. Refreshments provided. Whoa. Whoa. Proper attire required. Oh, look a hell of a hair. Featuring a guest list of celebrity commentators. I'd rather have a bottle in front of me than a front of a bottomy. It's True TV presents the world's dumbest partier. The fun begins now. Oh. After a night on the town, Jesse's at a friend's house, and he still feels like partying. Five. He's already down five shots, and he's determined to drink his hosts under the table. That's good. Because it's fruit punch. You may want to slow down there, player. Handle. Whoa. I don't know what recipe book he's reading from, but uh, I know what kind of cake. He's making. So you gotta be get ready for two shots. It's coming. Anybody wanna put two hundred bucks on it? Mm. Oh, oh, hold on. I'll take that two hundred. No problem. Have a couple more. I would tell you like an hour and a half in advance if I was gonna throw up. All right. <laughs> you all right, dog? Thanks for the two hundred bucks, ass. By the time Jesse recovers, his friends have had enough of him. Are you, are you not listening? Stop tripping, fool. Go. No, go, you go. go. No, no. Jesse. Three, go. Two, go. Three, go. Well, Jesse. One. Just go. go on, cows. Jesse. Dude, that was <laughs> Guys, at some point, you're no longer filming a fun party. You're just filming a murder you committed. <laughs> I didn't think that was gonna happen. Well, what the f did you think was gonna happen? You all right? You knocked him out, dude. Well, you should have been breaking my house. I know, I told him. I, I gave him, like, so many warnings, dude. And with each warning, I gave him a shot. I don't get what went wrong. Let's just give him a pillow and let him pass out right here. He'll appreciate that in the morning when he wakes up at the bottom of the stairs. Like, well, at least they gave me a pillow. These are good friends. Like true friends, Jesse's buddies finally call the paramedics. who determine that Jesse is indeed only passed out. That's Hollywood. One day, you're the coolest guy in the world with a bandana. And the next, you're unconscious at the bottom of the stairs without your bandana. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please turn your attention to the happy couple for the cutting of the cake. Okay, so here's the cake. Oh, okay. <laughs> wow. Oh, candle, it looks great. Why do you have a cake full of candles at a freaking wedding? Blow out the candles. Do you want us to blow them out now? What do they do? Like, they make a wish? Please don't get divorced. Please don't get divorced. <laughs> all right, we'll blow, we'll blow them all out. We'll blow them out. Ready? <laughs> when I got married at my wedding cake, there were no candles. So the little bride, little groom, the groom was crying. Oh, trick candles. <laughs> oh yeah, trick candles. The party started. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Yay, you're married. Yay. Blow out the candles. Uh. <laughs> oh. My bad. My bad. This is your first day of the rest of your life. And you're scorched. <laughs> uh, let me see the cake. Uh, no, it's, it's, it's fine. Cake is fine, everyone. No one gives a about the bride. All they give a about is the cake. Looks like everyone's okay, folks. Nothing more to see here. Enjoy the cake. Can I, can I get a slice from the part that didn't get that stuff on it? I would like to tell this newly married happy couple, don't worry. 
All of my marriages have gone up in flames, and I'm still fine. <laughs> A group of friends enjoy some beers while doing tricks around the campfire. Check it out, check it out, check it out, check it out. Oh, yeah, go, man. Oh, well, at least he was wearing those gloves. Oh, my God. Oh, that's his skin. That is his skin. Oh, God. Oh, oh yeah. Gross. Oh. Kid could have put his hand in a panini maker for an hour and a half and would have done that kind of damage. That's bad, man. Yeah, I think he did some damage. Thanks, nurse. What? What gave it away? Was it that his hand is now two hands? Now it's a mini gross hand sticking off his other? Is that how you diagnose that? Yeah, I think he did some damage. So I would say it's a partial second, yeah. third, definitely. Yeah. He got third degree burns and first degree stupid. Fortunately, the man in his hand would make a full recovery from the scorching. Fire and gymnastics never really works out, does it? Unless you're a... Circus poodle or something. Coming up, the worst Spider-Man sequel yet. Check me out, fucking walk on walls. Yeah. The spider sense is tingling, as is his shoulders, neck, and spinal cord. And James, don't piss there. What are you doing, James? You're not. Man. That's why I used to scotch guard everything. <laughs> and later, a musical tribute to Ladies Night Out. When World's Dumbest Partiers continues. A surprise guest is about to make an appearance at a birthday party in Costa Rica. Spider-Man's career has really fallen off. Spider-Man's fantastic. Check me out, fucking walk on walls. Yeah. Spider sense is tingling, as is his shoulders, neck, and spinal cord. I'm a superhero! Oh! 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 I'm out for Spider-Man. Oh. I respect that he tries to get up in character. If they like that, maybe the pain will go away. I'm getting paid for this. Okay. Uh, nice to meet you, birthday boy. Okay, okay. Hello, Mr. Spider-Man. I'd like to congratulate you for completely ruining my birthday party. Okay, have a good life. Take it easy. The sore superhero avoids a sticky situation and even stays for cake and ice cream. I am just like a spider! No! No, I'm not. Every year, crowds flock to the Ozark Mountain Adventure Games, a week-long celebration of Southern culture and heritage. And after a few beers, one attendee, Wayne Hawley, demonstrates a local tradition. <laughs> wow, that's, that's pretty good. I wonder what else he can do. Well, turns out Wayne is capable of more than just smashing a beer can on his head. Oh, Dude is wham. Oh, 
in New Jersey heats up, a group of friends decide to cool off. My nipples blow up like oh. laryngitis. Their fault. What? My nipples blow up like oh. laryngitis. Laryngitis of the nipples? What happens? They cough? <coughs> That's weird. You know, catch one in the gonads. I figured, okay, let's go back in, have a drink, and watch sports. Nope. That was great. <laughs> <laughs> Do the other. I want to see this one. Dude, hey, get this one, man. Just make sure you get it in front of my cast so I can see you. Yeah! Oh. Oh. Warning objects in the mirror may be closer than they appear. Incoming! <sighs> When my side view mirror is missing, I never think that this is the backstory. I like to leave a mark on society, not on my forehead, but I did both today. I remember this time, I had a good time doing it. And to think, it all happened on Beer Belly Boulevard. <laughs> yeah! Oh! Oh! <laughs> St. Louis, Missouri. Some women celebrate Mardi Gras at an outdoor bar. One of them has had a few too many and is escorted out by a bouncer. Ma'am, why do you concern yourself less with the fashion choices that gentleman's making and more with the fact that your friend's committing a misdemeanor? They're kicking your friend out. They are? Yeah, look like that. Is that your friend? Because she's like, not in jail. Yeah. Oh, no. She's violently refusing to go, though. Yeah, we take a picture of me. Forget her. Take this picture of me. Goldfish are very similar in that their memories both five seconds long. They're kicking her out. Yeah, they're kicking her out. That's funny. She's too drunk. She's too drunk. Whereas we are holding it together. <laughs> what? They're kicking out my friend? That's cool. I'm just gonna make out with this brick wall. <laughs> Be safe. Have a good night. It was 
Nice to meet you. Horrible examples of humanity. <laughs> Coming up. He was so drunk, he thought the trash can was the one who was laughing at him. Thus, another reason to move out of your parents' basement. <laughs> the last time I saw a dude this out of it, we were stealing his kidneys. When World's Dumbest Partiers continues. After a long night of drinking, Bill has passed out on the couch. Hitting the ball. Hitting the ball, bro. <laughs> this is horrible. We're all going to hell. Don't they throw anything out? How many beer boxes did they have in that place? Get the walk out front. The last time I saw a dude this out of it, we were stealing his kidneys. <laughs> what is it Shakespeare said about friendship? They are rich who have true friends. <laughs> you better check on him, man. Someone want to check on him via throwing a bike on him? No. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Now help him out, man. He's out, dude. Check his pulse. Seriously, check his pulse. Seriously. It's nice to see someone still has a drop of humanity in this post-apocalyptic basement. Seriously, check his pulse. Seriously. He's fine? Yeah. He's cool. Oh, is he fine? Okay, then continue beating him in the head. Shoot. Set. Bill wakes up with some mysterious bruises to complement his hangover. Bell. Bell. <laughs> That's why you don't pass out. Shoot. Set. Thousands are gathered for a five-day-long New Year's party at a campsite in New Zealand. Yeah, it's a festival! It's the greatest time of my life! <laughs> One happy camper approaches a kiddie pool that has been used to chill drinks, but now holds a mixture of urine and vomit. Oh, God, who peed in the pool? Oh, it was everyone? Oh, that sucks. Oh, yeah, you like you. I'm a bull coming to get you. Stay there. Stay there. Careful, man. I think he's trying to trick you. Stay there. Here I come. Here you go. Ah, big whoop. It's just a pool full of the odd piece of sick and a little wee. Maybe a floater. I'm a bull. I'm going to fuck you. Oh. First time, I felt sorry for you. The second time, nothing but contempt and enjoyment. Pure enjoyment. Yeah. I'm a bull coming to get you. Get away! Ew, and don't touch him! Ew! Good luck hooking up the rest of the festival.
police pull over a suspected drunk driver. What's going on, man? Nothing. What you doing driving? I'm worried at my friend's house. Oh, yeah, all right, all right. Forget about the DUI. Can they arrest him for that tank top? When you don't squeal your tire, take it off back there at that red light. Think you in the drag race or something? Huh? Right there. If he was trying to be a race car driver, um, not really gonna happen in a Honda. Stay right here. Come over here. Stand on, stand on that line for me. Face me. Face me. I want to look at your eyes for a minute. Face me. I'm blind in my right eye. What? I'm blind in my right eye. You're blind in your right eye. He's blind in one eye, but he's so drunk that his left eye is seeing double. So it's all even. What's your last name, David? I don't know. You don't know? I don't care. Well, which one is it, Dave? I don't know or I don't care. And what a weird last name, by the way. You're under arrest for DUI, partner. Okay, Dave, come on back here for me, partner. I could do a lot worse. How could you do a lot worse? You're wearing an ugly tank, you have a pinto, and you're wasted and you have one eye. I don't do nothing. Oh, Dave, you shouldn't be driving, partner. You ain't sitting in my seat. Come on over here. Come on. James has just returned home from a night on the town. <laughs> what the f are you doing? James, don't piss there. What are you doing? James, you're not in the bathroom, man. Guy gets drunk, guy goes home, pisses himself. It happens every day in history. <laughs> oh, oh, oh f man. Yo, what? You're pissing off your couch. Are you pissing? You're pissing yourself right now. What? That's why I used to scotch guard everything. Because when friends get drunk, you don't know what they're going to do. You're pissing off your couch. Are you pissing? You're pissing yourself right now. What kind of creep takes a video of someone pissing on themselves? What is the matter with you? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh you're peeing. Oh, you're going to pee yourself. There's that pee all over yourself. Yeah, why don't you move around? You want to do some push ups? <laughs> you're soaking wet. <laughs> I've seen people piss their pants, but if you piss your shirt, you are a Hall of Fame level drunk. <laughs> That's the funniest I have ever seen. Oh my god. No, no, it's not the funniest thing ever. You need to get out more. Maybe go to a comedy club. Say something truly entertaining. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. You are ridiculous. <laughs> Coming up. Let's get it on! The world's dumbest drinking game. Whoa! Oh, Who the f plays dodgeball? It sucked when you were a kid, and then it sucks even more when you're an adult. And later. Uh, easy, easy. Easy. Yeah. Gotcha. Uh, yeah, there we go. I think that he can have one last six pack, but that is it. Oh. After that, I think he's gonna be over the limit. Uh. Ah. When world's dumbest partiers continues. <laughs> Warsaw, Poland. A drunk pedestrian staggers into the street. Wait, 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 wait. Come here. Let me, let me in the car. Let me in the car. Let me in the car. Hey, hey. Let me in the car. Oh, screw you. Screw you. What the hell are you? Yeah, I'm walking here. I like you, Polish man. Who doesn't want to punch traffic in the face sometimes? This is what I have for you, huh? Ah. <laughs> That's something you can't unsee. Dude, we don't want to see your ass. Okay, wait. Ah. Oh, feels so good. Or your penis flopping around in the wind, okay? Pull them up. Talk about kielbasa. Look at it. Look at it. You like, you like it? Let me shake it on your car here. Yeah. Oh! Shake it down. Look at here. Look at here. Look at it. 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 Look at it
Come on, dude. Move it. What? Not impressive. I got one too, buddy. Take it off. Take it off with my dollars in. Wait, 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 okay, wait, wait, no, 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 seriously, seriously, I'm so sorry, so sorry. just let me, oh, put my buttocks on your hood. I wonder how this is all gonna end. <laughs> Maybe with, oh, there they are, the police. I put on gloves, no, no. Too late for that. Hey, don't leave me alone. Try to hit me, I show them my truck. Put your hands down. I am poor a citizen, I have right to show sausage. Can't be negative, it's it's okay. okay. Once this Polish man was released from jail, he rejoined his friends and they screwed in a light bulb. Okay, now I told you a terrible joke. Please, release my daughter. Shut the f up. At a Jersey Shore house party, these revelers have invented a new game. Yeah, and it's gone. Drunk dodgeball. <laughs> it's going down. Oh! On Who the f plays dodgeball? It sucked when you were a kid, and then it sucks even more when you're an adult. Yeah. Oh, you guys are horrible! <laughs> This does not seem like a safe activity. What? Oh, cool. Okay, now I'm good. Hit me with your best shot. One, two, three. Repeat. Oh, here we go. Somebody got hurt. You mean that empty beer box helmet didn't protect her face? Are you serious? Yeah, it's I'm like sorry, it. I really didn't expect that. See, this is my weak spot. My students are right there, right there. Maybe you should have taken one of those boxes and sculpted it into a mouth guard to protect your teeth from going through your face. My students are right there, right there. <laughs> Your incisors just came through your lips, man. It's a tough chick. Put him in. Guys, I'm let's go. Face. I want to play. I'm in. Boy, are these kids going to be bummed to find out that MTV already has a show about drunk idiots in New Jersey. That's going to be a sad day. One, two, three. Oh, here we go. Somebody got hurt. A man waits for the train after a long night of partying in Boston. Oh, what a freaking party. Oh, I am wicked tired. I never want to see that red circle around myself, because that pretty much means something terrible is going to happen. Oh, I drank way too much whiskey. Them hot dogs were awful. Oh, man. General alert. Do not stand anywhere near the edge of the platform when you're drunk. Oh, come on, where's the train at? Oh, 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 oh that was wicked blast. Okay, for this guy to be that drunk and still pull off the double front somersault access springboard, that's impressive. This is Drake coming up. Oh, oh. Somebody help him. Call the ambulance. Oh, oh. Get down here. Come on, the train's gonna come, buddy. As you notice, no one jumped in, because you do have the electric rail, which will fry your nuts off. Come on down, get down here. No, no, you get up. Oh. Come on, come on. Come on, get up. Dude, I'm so f***ed up. Help me. I ain't going down on that track. Get the f*** up, come on. Oh, my God, you guys are awesome. Thank you so much. The man is taken to the hospital and treated for minor injuries. Oh, <gasps> Phillies fans take to the streets to celebrate winning the National League Championship Series. That's it. Yeah. Police have covered the city's lampposts with grease to prevent revelers from climbing them. Like that's gonna stop a drunk dude from Philly.
something like scale the pole, then what's your reward? They throw whiskey bottles at you. Hey, Bob. All right. Peace. I am for the village. Ah. I want to you. It's always good to, like, get up in a crowd of people and give them the finger. How embarrassing. If you think that's embarrassing, you should wait till they have to ride them back to the station on the handlebars. How inept are these bike cops? They're falling on each other like a house of cards. I mean, how many Philly bike cops does it take to take down one guy? That's Philadelphia for you, baby. Coming up. Luckily, her head broke her fall. Plus, party fouls galore. Whoa. Whoa. Not even close. When world's dumbest partiers continues. Some Florida friends have come up with a new party trick. Sliding downstairs in a storage bin. This woman has been awarded the courage badge for going first. You know, I'll say it. Uh, I think the word courage is being thrown around a little too loosely here. This will never be done. <laughs> Everyone else there needs to get an encouraging a stupid idea badge. This will never be done. That's who you want to drink with. People who are as deluded as you are. Luckily, her head broke her fall. It's not like she uses that much. I'll catch you with this pillow for your head. The rest of your body will just sort itself out. You know what the translation of courage is when you slide down the stairs in a basket? Yeah. Where's the courage? Oh, no! This was not a failure of her courage. Um, the courage cart let her down. Bobby Black is known around his Florida neighborhood for being a partier who'll do anything. Skateboard's over there. Heck, I'd like to try that. Seems like this guy probably skateboards as much as he showers. Have anticipated that this might not work out. Now he's Bobby Black and Blue. Now you're not just a partier, you're an accomplice. He's so drunk, he doesn't even realize that he was unconscious. Do it again! Do it again! The skateboarding didn't work the first time, but maybe now that he's got a concussion, maybe now everything will go great. of a success the second time. Yeah. He remains conscious. So thumbs up, Bobby. You keep at it. Yeah. 
An Arkansas motorist fails a sobriety test and is placed under arrest. What did you do wrong? You got her driving and you're intoxicated. At the station house, he gives up the right to remain silent. My information is you, 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 you. Have you read it? Have you read it? He turned into like a six year old that just learned the curse word. This guy was awesome. You're redheaded. Take my shirt. It'll match. It'll look pretty on you. Hey, what's that mean? Suck my Suck my and suck my more. It's is huge. I can't tell you the number of times I've been beaten by cops until I confessed how big my like, if you want to, if you feel me showing my it's like nine inches. I've got the biggest like, it's unbelievable. If I had a nine inch penis, I might try and drop it into conversations too. My friends told me that he shouldn't wear white beaters anymore. They're kind of out of style. He should wear a v-neck. I was like, look, I like white beaters, man. The white beard looks good, the v-neck looks good. I feel good, it's kind of cool. All of a sudden it's a t-shirt commercial. V-neck? White beater. Wow. Are you gonna take the right there? No, I think stand up. No, no, stand up. Oh, no, nothing. You, you, you. I think the message of this clip is very, very clear. Ah, uh, you. Oh, no, nothing. You, 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 you. At this beer bash in Oakland, California, a man tries to relive his glory days. Uh, I just want to ask that. Hey, you gotta give me one leg. I already saw the other leg. God, it's so sick how quickly people forget everything they learned in college. Not even close. Whoa. keg stand. Come on, dude. Watch and learn. Okay? You kids today. I'm 50 and I can do a keg stand. Whoa. Why are you over there? And he's over there and I'm still right here. The only thing sadder than watching adults try to do a keg stand is watching adults argue about why it didn't go well afterwards. Dudes, just stop arguing. You are blocking that kid's path to the keg. Dude, my that was so many dude. Oh my god. If this were 1983, that little kid would be me. Hey kid, this is your Christmas future. Get out of the house. Whoa. You've gone shot for shot with 19 stupid partiers. But the hardest partier of all is sticking around for one more drink. Find out who it is when we return. convenience store on an ocean liner in the middle of a terrible storm. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, beer, 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 beer. Ah, oh, oh, ah. I think there's a chance his ponytail just might be too heavy. Uh, okay. Beer. I think that 
he can have one last six pack, but that is it. After that, I think he's gonna be over the limit. Uh, uh, uh. He looked like a little baby calf being born. Just trying to learn how to stand for the first time. The... Are you, you okay there? You're a young man. Young man, are you okay? You need some help? Do you, uh... Are you, you need some help there? I don't think I've ever seen anyone that drunk in my life. That is a get. Okay, wait, wait, hold on. Hey, hey, hey! Ah! Son of a gun. Just hold, let me just. Ah! Did that bowl offset the magnetic pole of that convenience store? What the f happened with that bowl? <laughs> Employees call the paramedics, who find the man passed out in uh, front of the store. First, uh, first, uh, He's taken to a medical center for treatment. The only medical treatment he needs is a bed so he can sleep it off. Steady, steady, set, easy. Oh, uh, easy. Uh, this, uh. this is Danny Baladucci with another one for you. This one's going out to my favorite kind of woman. Enjoy. Enjoy. <laughs>